Doug and I have been through a lot together. Happy times and sad. When I was accepted in the priesthood, Doug was there waiting for me with a huge hug and a Bible that was signed by Cardinal Enders. And when his parents, Merle and Irene, passed, God rest their souls, I cried as if they were my own. You know, my grandmother once told me that the true measure of friendship isn't, isn't how you feel about someone else. It's about how, how they make you feel about yourself. And uh, I can honestly say that I've never had a friend to make me feel the way that you have, Doug. Uh, um, I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, when Doug called me and, and told me that he wanted to propose, I was, I was, I was nervous. I was probably just as nervous as he was. And I remember asking him, are you sure she's the one? He told me he, uh... Stop. Just, uh, stop. What are you doing, Doug? Are you sure that you want to go through with this? Thanks, Jimmy. I got it from here. Hi. I've got something to say. None of this is real. Uh -oh. What? See, although the flowers are beautiful and the salad dressing is great, we're not married, Gretchen and I. We can't be because my friend Vic is not a priest. Oh shit, here we go. Yeah, in fact, he's not even in the army. His real name is Jimmy, and I hired him to be my best man because I had no other options. Same with all my groomsmen. I actually don't even know their real last name. And it's Japanese. Good to meet you guys. So, please stay and enjoy the cake. <laughs>